So today, I'm doing potatoes. Potatoes, yeah? That's them boiling in the pot. They've been like cut into little bits, yeah? To make it easier for them to boil. So I'm gonna do some mashed potatoes once they've boiled and they're nice and soft. And I'm doing some sausages. Can you see that? Sausages, yeah? So I'm gonna put them on the tray to go into the oven, like that. Obviously, you've got to spread them out so they don't like, all, you know, get too close to each other. Give them a bit of room, a bit of room to um, get, like, you know, browned up. So that's them spread out. Can you see that? Yeah. So they're going in the oven. And those ones are cool. You can get these from any, any supermarket. These ones are called, I don't know if you can see that. Caramelised red onion pork sausages. You, you get them gluten free. So gluten free, it would be good if you can get them gluten free. Gluten free is good for you. Six of them. See? See that one? One, two, three, four, five, six. So they can go in the oven. I've had the oven preheated. I've got, um, what's it called? I've got one of those, um, um, electric ovens so I haven't got gas but I've got electric so the number the setting I'll put it on the temperature see it's in there you can see that it's hot in there isn't it can you see it glowing that means it's hot yeah I know I've got a light on in there as well but that hot glowing look means it's set for the sausages to go in nicely yeah so I had it preheated for about uh, 10 minutes and it's on, the fan oven is on, because it's broken, you can't really see what it's on. And the prints kind of run out. So it's on uh, 180. I normally put it on 180. Anything I put in the oven is going to go on 180. Unless I'm doing a long stew. Do you know what I mean? You want those stews that take a long time. You know, Well, if you want it to take a long time to cook. Slow cook, I think they call it. Slow cook. So that's what I'm having for dinner. Boiled potatoes, which I'm going to mash, and when I mash them, I'm going to add some milk. I use, um, what's it called? Um, um, not soy milk. What's it called? Let me go to the fridge and find out. I can't remember what it's called again. It's called, yeah, it's called um, almond, almond milk. And um, I put a bit of milk in with butter, and then I mix it all in together. And then it gives you a nice, soft, fluffy mash. And then I have that with my bangers. Yeah, so there's six in there. So me and my husband, we're going to have three each. Can you see that? Gluten-free. Now, you don't have to get it from Asda, but you can get it from any, any shop you want. I've got mine from Asda, but I'm not advertising for Asda. Okay, and uh, then again, I'm going to do some nice vegetables. I've got some vegetables like... Let me just... Uh, no, you can't see me in this one, because <laughs> I can't, you know, show you what I'm doing as well as like show me so that's the vegetables i did last night that's left over from last night so we're gonna add those heat those up and um that's gonna boil the potatoes are gonna boil for about i don't know you just get a fork about 20 minutes i think and you just get a fork like this and you just test them out like that and if they're too hard you know they need more boiling if the fork can't go through softly right the way through like you need them they you know they need more boiling so keep doing that say like every 10 minutes and it doesn't matter if they will you know fall apart because you're going to crush them anyway into mashed potato some people say taters i think the americans say taters don't they taters I'm gonna do some taters now. You gonna get me some boiling water. You get the boiling water and I'll do the taters. Now hurry up now. I'll do the taters. Yeah, they go on like that sometimes, don't they? They're a bit over the top, these Americans, aren't they? Anyway, so let me show you what's in the oven. Let's see, I've got a glass, glass cover on the oven. Can you see that? Yeah, that's those sausages I just put in there. So they will take about I don't know, I, I look at them every 10 minutes 
And once they're browned, I'll turn them over after 10 minutes. Now you don't want to keep them in there for too long because they get too crispy. They're not very nice when they're burnt and crispy, are they? I mean, some people like them like that, but you know, you want them still to look like sausages, you know. Not like they're being incinerated or something like that. Incinerated fingers, you know what I mean? Can you imagine that? Can you imagine if these were fingers being incinerated? Human fingers. Oh my gosh. Oh, I can't bear the thought of it. Anyway, <coughs> oh, excuse me. I'm going to have a glass of wine now. So I'm going to come back to these taters. I'm going to come back to these taters and see if they're cooked in 10 minutes. After 10 minutes. And if they ain't, I'm going to make them cook for another 10. Yeah, that's how they go on, isn't it? They kind of think they're fancy, these, these um, you know, American cooks, don't they? They think they know it all. I don't think they do, though. I mean, I bet they can't cook potatoes like this, like I have. Oh, by the way, I put a cube in. Remember I told you about this, the um, cube, the stock cube? I put one of those in as well, innit? So the flavour can go into the potatoes while they're boiling. So when you mash it, you're going to taste some of that stock cube. It was a chicken stock cube I put in. And you mash it, like I say, you put some milk in to make it nice and soft and fluffy. And your margarine or butter. Mix it all in and you've got a nice mashed potato. Anyway, cheers. That's me wine there. I hope you enjoy. Um, I, I would show you myself, but I don't know. I don't know how to do it. Anyway. I'll come back to you later and let you know how the uh, bangers and mash went. And the veggies as well. Okay. Bye. Hang on a minute. Let me see if I can turn it round. But it might just sign off, isn't it? Let's see. Can you see me? Can you see me there? I don't know if you can see me because I can't see you. I don't know. Anyway, I don't know if I'm holding the camera up far enough or down or it's too low. Anyway... I don't know what is it. Ah, oh, is that showing me kitchen? Yeah. I think it's show. Oops. Oh, you don't want to see all that. It's a mess. <laughs> all right. I'll catch you later. Cheese.